Mr. Utterson was sitting by his fireside one evening after dinner, when he was surprised to receive a visit from Poole. Bless me, Poole, what brings you here, he cried. And then taking a second look at him, What ails you, he added, is the doctor ill? Mr. Utterson, said the man, there is something wrong. Take a seat, here's a glass of wine for use of the lawyer. Now take your time and tell me plainly what you want. You know the doctor's ways, sir, replied Poole, and how he shuts himself up. Well, he's shut up again in the cabinet, and I don't like it, sir. I wish I may die if I like it, Mr. Utterson. Sir, I am afraid. Now, my good man, said the lawyer, be explicit. What are you afraid of? I've been afraid for about a week, returned Poole, doggedly disregarding the question and I can bear it no more. The man's appearance amply bore out his words. His manner was altered for the worse, and except for the moment when he had first announced his terror, he had not once looked the lawyer in the face. Even now he sat with the glass of wine untasted on his knee, and his eyes directed to a corner of the floor. I can bear it no more, he repeated, 